Hey guys, it's Jen from Beauty Riot X, and today we are doing Battle of the Boxes. My first part will be Boutique, because that's what came first. So again, this is the Boutique box. This is the Korean Beauty box. It comes with full-size products. It's just as affordable as, I think it's like a few dollars more than BoxyCharm, but still completely worth it. My months are always kind of lagging. Usually my Boutique's my boutique box is a month behind my boxy charm. So this is the July box and I will be pitting it against boxy charms August box. The theme for this box is summer sweets. Treat your skin after a long hot day in the sun. This month we're bringing you a sweet assortment of delicious summer delights to refresh your beauty routine. I'm intrigued already. Oh, okay. And a little sticker says you're a peach. And normally it has things that come like in a little makeup bag and then things outside of the bag that don't fit. So, the first thing I see looks like a little mitt, and let's see what this is. Okay, it's like a little bathing mitt, and this is an exfoliating spa mitt. It retails for $6. Get the most out of your soap with this exfoliating spa mitt. Gently sloughs away dead skin cells while providing a luxurious, a luxurious lather that cleans and softens. How could I not say that? Okay, so, I like anything that exfoliates any part of your body, so I will definitely use this. All right, the next thing I see outside the box looks so fun. I don't even know what it is. And this is the Wang Skin Cherry Foaming Soap. This retails for $7. This cherry scented soap smell, looks as good as it smells. It's just like candy, but also packed with natural skin savers like jojoba oil, aloe, mulberry, cactus, and, and cactus extracts. Also contains hyaluronic acid, squalling to moisturize and repair skin's natural barrier. Can be used on face and body. That's fantastic. All those things sound good. So let's open it and give it a sniff. Oh, well, maybe I won't open it, but I can smell through the packaging. It smells like cherries and this is just kind of adorable. All right, the next thing outside of the bag is two masks. I have a silicone, silicone, silicone mask cover by Epois or a pew, I'm not sure how to pronounce it, but it's, this is retails for $6. Become the ultimate K-beauty enthusiast with this reusable silicone sheet mask cover. The mask cover rests, oh, it rests on top of your sheet mask. Oh, that's a great idea. So this goes on top of any other sheet mask that you use to help hold the essence in, keep it from sliding. It kind of hooks around your ears. I'm super excited about that. Okay, the next is an actual sheet mask. This is by the Wangen Effect, and it's the Honey Bomb Mask, and it has the three steps. It has the Honey Milk and Ampule and the actual mask right here. This retails for $6. All right, and here is the bag. All right, and I have gotten this actual bag before, like not what's inside it, I don't know what's inside it, but I have actually gotten this bag and I think it's cute. Oh my God, I'm so excited, yes! Okay, I'll do the non-exciting thing first. Okay, this is the Seamool Water Candy Tint in Soft Persimmon, it's like a orangey, I guess it's a lip tint. It retails for $11. Satisfy your sweet tooth without the calories. This lip tint can be used to create trendy gradient lips or a full plump pout with color that will last all day. It contains honey and hyaluronic acid. Let's open it and give it a, okay, it's got a little doe foot applicator. And I'm pretty, oh shit, it's very liquidy. <laughs> okay, and that's how it looks. It's like an orangey kind of lip tint. That's fun. Let me clean this up real quick. Crap. All right, well, don't pay attention to now the mess that is on the next thing I'm going to open. So that's fun. <laughs> it does leave a little bit of a stain. That's cool. That's fine. I really don't care. I'm so excited about this. This is the Farm Stay All-in-One Honey Ampule. Wait till you see this. It's, like, beyond cute. <gasps> oh, my God. Yes! I'm so excited. I've been looking for this, and I didn't know which one to buy. Some of them are really expensive, so I'm so excited that I got this. Okay, this is the Farm Stay All-in-One Honey Ampule. I know you guys are looking at this like, are they pills? What the hell is this? Is it paint? It looks like the paint jars from, like, elementary school. This retails for $26. This full-sized ampule is a sweet deal. Honey, adenosine, and niacinamide work to brighten your complexion, plump fine lines, and leave skin soft and glowing. After cleansing and toning skin, use the provided spatula to, to dispense a generous amount of product into hands. Apply evenly to face, pat in until absorbed. Follow with the rest of your skincare. This ampule is also good to apply before your favorite sheet mask for additional moisture. I'm so excited. Okay, I can't wait to try this. Let me actually smell it and see if it's... It doesn't smell like honey, but it actually smells really good. I will definitely tell you guys what I think about this, but... Okay, so that was... <laughs> this alone makes it a pretty amazing box for me, although everything else I did actually really like. So that was it for my boutique. Stay tuned right now for BoxyCharm. 
and then we'll see who wins. Not that it really matters, you don't win anything except a good job from me. Today we have our second half of Battle of the Boxes with BoxyCharm, and this is the box for August. So without further ado, we're gonna get right into it. All right, so the theme of this box is Beach Please, and the first thing I see is, it's from Tarte. And this is their Rainforest of the Sea Volume 2 Eyeshadow Palette. Oh, actually, I will tell you what it retails for. It retails for $36. All right, the next is Lashes, and these are from Pure, and these are the Pro Lashes, and good for up to 30 wears. And these retail for $14. All right, the next we have an eyeliner by Bella Pierre, and this is in the color Ebony, and it's actually sealed. I'm not going to open it. It's just a black eyeliner. And this is worth $15. All right, I have two things left. One is by Beauty Crop, and this is the liquid lipstick in Date Night. And it's kind of, kind of from what it looks like, it kind of looks like a warm, yeah, like an orangey kind of nude color. Oh, this actually could have been perfect for today. It's really pretty. And I don't actually think I have this color in any other brand, so that's fun. And that retails for $14.95. The last product in here is a brush set by Moda Pro. And this retails for $26. It's by Royal and Lionicle. Well, that's pretty cool. It comes with a pointed brush, a chisel brush, and a crease brush. I was actually gonna be like, oh, I'll save it for a giveaway, but I kind of want to open oh, No, I'm gonna open it. All right, so these are the three brushes. They have like this weird texture down here. We have the pointed brush, the chisel brush, and the crease brush, which I'm just gonna give the crease brush. Oh, okay, that feels nice. It's soft, but not too soft to where you feel like it's not gonna even touch your shadow. I will definitely use this. I don't even know what you do with this thing. Like, that's just, I'm assuming it's a contour. Highlight or contour. Okay, because it kind of curves to your cheekbones and kind of indents. That's kind of cool. But I feel like because it's so short and dense, densely packed, that it might like move stuff around that you don't want moved around like your foundation or something. So I'll have to mess around with this. And then the last is the pointed brush and this is for blush, powder, pretty much anything. And they're all really nice. Actually, I've gotten Royal Net Lang Nickel in the past and I didn't like them. They were like kind of hard and coarse and just not really feeling that great. But these feel very, very nice. So I will definitely be using these. All right, so that was it for my Battle of the Boxes. And I think, I know you probably assume I'm gonna let BoxyCharm win because of this, and while this is very cool, I have a million colors like this, so I'll probably save this for a giveaway. So I think I'm actually gonna have to give it to Boutique. Congratulations, Boutique, you did it. World's best cup of coffee. And so that was it, guys. Um, I hope you enjoyed watching, and stay tuned for more videos. Please like this if you enjoyed, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and until next time, I'll see you guys later. Bye, guys.